Este, mañana para Puerto Rico y ya la isla tiene un nuevo campeón mundial. Tomorrow we're heading back home to Puerto Rico and Puerto Rico has a brand new world champion. I'll have uh, Brian come up and say a few words as well. Hi everyone, I'm very excited. Thank you for the, all the support. I want to thank uh, Hospital de la Hoya, Golden Boy Promotions, Eric Gomez, all the special team, Robert Diaz for, for believing in us and uh, here Miguel Cotto is back. Six time world champion for the division. And thank you for all the support and no for, say, not for long. <laughs> no, that's right. Not for long. And thank you for all you know, Trey Rose, Gavin, Marvin, all the team. It's been a, a was a great camp, was a tough one. We made it through and here he is. The glory to God. Thank you. All right. Um, I want to have Freddie say a few words first and then we'll have uh, the champion talk. So Freddie. Yes, um, he fought a good fight. I mean, come a guy came. I never saw a guy like that before in my life. <laughs> I mean, he, I mean, he doesn't really know what's good for him, I don't think. But um, he's the toughest guy I ever saw in my life. I mean, he took some shots. Miguel's a good puncher, believe me. I, I've been hit. I know. <laughs> he, but um, it was a great performance, and they boxed well. I was very proud of him. He did well. And um, come a guy. You're a tough guy. <laughs> Thank you, Freddie. Thank you. All right, now, we'll have the champion say a few words. Congratulations, Miguel. We love you. Uh, we're proud of you. You know, you, you've given us many, many great fights, and tonight was no exception. Uh, the great Miguel Cotto. Thank you, Eric. Thank you, everybody, to be here. I'm happy to be back. Uh, it was... Uh, Tough fight, tough opponent, but we did what we came here to do. Uh, we became a champion for six time, and we're happy. Another world champion for Puerto Rico. Thank you. Questions? Anybody? Questions? Miguel, um, Freddie said that he's never seen anyone like a uh, comic guy before. What was it like when you'd hit him and then there'd be a little space and he'd run at you? What, what were you thinking when those things would happen? Uh, I never saw anyone <laughs> like that, neither, you know? <laughs> he was a tough guy, tough opponent, but thankfully we did uh, a real good job during the training camp and we won the fight. Well, what did you think you would clean, hit him with clean shots and his neck would kind of stay in a position and then it kind of come back? What, what were your thoughts about that? You know, he, he was just... Uh, Really tough opponent, uh, but I have to do what we did on the gym, what we, what, what, what we planned on the gym, and I'm really proud with my performance back there, and we're happy. Miguel, I'm tiring. You, uh, you landed a ton of shots. How are your hands feeling? Because you said you want to do the fight in December. How, I mean, after all them punches, how are the hands feeling after this fight? Everything is going to be fine. In December, believe me. Miguel, ¿qué es que quedas con esta pelea y próximamente, pues, planeas, no, en diciembre esta pelea? ¿Qué experiencia te dejó este este combate? No, Camagay es el 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 oponente más fuerte que he tenido frente a mí. Ha sido un oponente el cual ha aguantado más de lo que nunca imaginé. Así que mis respetos, mis más sinceros respetos a, a Yoshihiro y nada, y ahora esperar a recuperarnos un poco y ya para principios de octubre regresar al, al ring para estar listo para diciembre. Through 839 punches in the fight, how tiring is it to hit somebody that often and have them keep coming? I mean, how, were you wondering how hard you were going to have to work to hurt this guy? You know, I, uh, I came here to win the fight. Uh, I didn't count. <laughs> How many punches I throw there? I threw there, but I'm happy with the performance. Freddy, Freddy, Gavin, Brian, Hector, and I, we did a great job during the training camp, and everybody saw it right there. Nos, nos preparamos para una pelea dos asaltos, que fue lo que tuvimos aquí. Eh, tuvimos un oponente realmente fuerte frente a nosotros, pero, pero gracias a Dios eh, eh, la condición eh, 
la preparación que obtuvimos en, en, en Los Ángeles, aquí en el Walker con Freddy, Gavin, los muchachos, pues fue, fue esencial, fue clave y obtuvimos la victoria. Miguel, por ahí en el noveno, el octavo round, un derechazo lo dejó parado, como petrificado a Kamegay. Todo el mundo esperaba que el Luz Morel parara la pelea. ¿Tú querías ya que la pararan ahí directamente? No, vine, vine, vine a hacer mi pelea, como todos pudieron ver, vine a hacer lo que, lo que, lo que todos vieron a, a, afuera. Eh, estoy contento con la demostración y simplemente tuve, tuve frente a mí un oponente realmente fuerte. Miguel, una pelea contra el ganador de Golovkin y Canelo sería una pelea de alto riesgo. ¿Crees que en este punto de tu carrera te debes exponer a pelear con alguien así? Otra bueno, vez? Vamos, veremos a ver qué, surge, qué ocurre de aquí a, a, a octubre, qué, qué pensamos eh, eh, iniciar nuevamente en este momento y, y, y veremos a ver qué haremos. What? Yeah, he asked me that about uh, uh, Canelo and Golovkin. They are uh, really tough opponent for for the last fight. But uh, my answer was that we have to wait until they happen. The the fight happens, and we'll see what happens next. You know, Miguel, you're, a, you're now a six-time world champion in four different divisions. Your legacy said you're going to be a first ballot Hall of Famer, no doubt. With that being said, for your title defense in December, you know, he's asking about Canelo and Triple G, the winner of that fight. Do you just take a, a fight for your fans in New York and, and, and give them a victory? Or do you take a, a fight like Triple G and Canelo? What do you want to do? Do you want to go out on your shield for your fans? I'm, I'm, I'm always, I'm always want to go there to face the best out there, you know? I don't know what happened next. I don't know what happened uh, in December, but we'll see. We'll see. Um, we, we are always going to go with the, with the best out there. How about the Puerto Rican opponent? What? A Puerto Rican opponent for the last fight. That would be good. Huh? <laughs> no, two Puerto Ricans against each other? Come on. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> hey, one more, guys. He has to go. Get some food and get some rest. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, guys. First of all, I'm First of all, I'm Gracias a todos. Thank you. Two warriors that that was a real fight tonight. Okay, let's get them.